I also, last Monday when I started with this gospel passage, began to look at it a little more closely, and I saw something else in there, something that I think touches you and me. When Peter replies to Jesus, Jesus says to him, Blessed are you. Blessed are you. Happy are you. A measure of joy is yours, Simon. And then he lays on him leadership. I started thinking about that, and I said to myself, gee, am I happy in a leadership role? Hmm. Well, I think so. On a busy, bad day, I think, gee, maybe Bishop would give me a small, quiet country parish out there someplace. Of course, the trouble is there's about 50 other guys that are in line ahead of me to get those places. But on most days, yeah, I'm okay. I am. I have a happiness. I have a measure of joy at what I do. Then I began to think about you, and I began to think about you as leaders. And I don't mean just leaders in your business or your profession. How about leaders as parents? Surely a call that God has given to you. Are you happy in your role as a parent? You find joy in doing what God has asked you to do, exercise authority over your children. I know, kids, not your favorite homily today, sorry. It's your role. He's called you to leadership, whether that be a leadership in your home or whether it be leadership in your place of work or whether it be people who work here in ministry, leadership in ministry. God calls us to that. And I have a feeling that he expects us to find that same joy in whatever leadership we've been given, on whatever level it's been given to us. I had a parent come out of church last night who has a bunch of teenagers and she was standing there, a mother, and all the teenagers were standing around her, and she said, now, um, let's see, because I talked about how at Caesarea Philippi, the Greeks had a shrine to the god Pan, and how they offered children, they sacrificed children, the pagan Greeks did, to God. So she said, now I guess that means that I can sacrifice my teenagers to God, as long as I do it with joy. I said, no, I think you've got the wrong idea. It's not exactly what we were talking about in the, in the scriptures today. Be the leader you're called to be and do it with a measure of joy. Be the leader that you're called to be in your workplace and do it with a measure of joy. Leadership is a gift that God bestows on us. Every one of you parents have been given that gift. Even if it's just in your house, you have been given that gift. Exercise it. Do it. Use the gift that he's given you and use it with some measure of joy. That's not the same as getting even with your kids. Do it with joy. He has placed you in this place as a sure peg holds up a tent in a storm. It's what you're meant to be. Be, let's all of us be what we're called to be and do it with a measure of happiness.